There was not one day where I wasn't laughing my head off or crying my eyes out or, you know, everything just worked. It was very fun for me to have him uh, want to collaborate with, with me in that way because it's not typical that you'll get a, a director that loves to co collaborate so closely with the artist and defer to you um, for ideas. And so I felt happy that it happened. And I think it was a machine that kind of fed itself. And um, anytime there was a scene where there was a chance to, to, to implement something that I thought was interesting <laughs> or funny, almost always it worked. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah. it, was, it was quite fun. Lakeith is a writer as much as he is an uh, actor and musician so there's one time we keep talking about where I said to him yo man Clarence how'd you say I got the streets on smash and what did you say <laughs> I got the cobblestones on lock <laughs> like, I, got, I got the cobblestones on lock so we were doing so many of those, so that's one of them I think they'll, they'll take away I got the cobblestones on lock Chase well his name is Chase, oh, Chase yeah, yeah um, he called um his character, a ding beetle, like, but the group of gypsies, he's called him yeah. a ding beetle, but it was something else like he before that. It? Yeah, he ad lived yeah. it. But I feel like when people hear that insult, it's so nice because of the way it comes off, but it's also so mean. <laughs> so you don't really know how to react to it, so you can throw it so much shady. Yeah. Like, oh yeah, that's gonna be used everywhere. Knowledge is stronger than belief. And I think the heart of it too is you are not a nobody. That's the line that keeps yeah, coming back to me because yeah. that's kind of Clarence's entire motivation throughout everything is to prove to himself mostly, but to um, the people around him that he's not. What are you trying to prove? And I'm not a nobody. The fight scenes are big. The music is big. The the visuals are big. It's you know, it's literally an epic film, and mm -hmm. and so that is best really witnessed and experienced in in a film setting. You want to feel the music too, because the music is such an important character mm -hmm. of the movie, also, right? If you can't feel the chariot hooves behind you, you feel me, or you can't feel the stones being rocked, or you can't hear and feel Clarence's breath when he's, you know, going through, say, it's not going, you know, feel the same. You want to see this in theaters because it, it, it gives that. You yeah. Feel me? You put it like that. 